So this is the axle that was most recently replaced right before our last ride. It was a 60 XT series. It's essentially an OEM replacement. $70 on Amazon. You know, it lasted like, I think, 57 minutes into the ride. You know, whether it was abuse or not, don't know. I mean, you know, I do have 28-inch Outlaw 2 tires on this thing. Not lifted, so it's got stock geometry. So, yeah, I will let you all decide on that. And I'm not saying anything bad against 60. What I did is I went ahead and ordered their 60 XTA series. A little bit more. You know, it says... I saw it on here. I don't know. Extreme duty. I think I saw their description online had a little bit more. So we are going to see. We're going to put it to the test. See if I can't break another one. Um, I don't think this one says anything. It just says heavy duty replacement, whatever. So, so we are. What are we up to? Um, three. Is it three OEM axles? Yeah. I got two covered under warranty. One was not. One was abuse. One was abuse. Yeah. Damn, that sucks. Huh? That sucks. That sucks? Yeah. What? I'm going back. I'm going to the to the water. So, we got the uh, 60 XTA installed today. And actually, I'll tell you what, it was one of the easiest axle changes I have ever done because I was sleeping and Woody was bored and he just decided to change it out for me. It's like, man, you know, I didn't get dirty. It just went, you know, without hitch, everything. But I will say, huh, did everything get put back together like it was supposed to? I don't know. <laughs> That's what I no would say. Extra parts. No extra parts. Oh dang! But so, anyways, so we're gonna see how this works out, and yeah, 
And one thing he did say, he didn't take a picture. He said the shaft on the XTA series was actually slimmer, skinnier than on the XT series. So I don't know if they just used, hopefully they just used better, better steel. Yeah, because normally, you know, your better ones are thicker on some of them. I don't know. So we'll see.